With polls showing a virtual dead heat in Ohio, Donald Trump brought his attention-grabbing presence to Westchester Sunday afternoon, fresh from calling John Kasich a baby after being accused of creating a toxic environment at Trump rallies. He's not going to do the job, okay? Not going to do the job. We have so many problems with this country. The lone disruption was timed by two infiltrators. who waited hours to provide Trump with arguably his best line of the night once they were escorted out. Makes it more exciting. We might have a couple of more. Anybody else want to stand up right now? Uh. Trump is undeniably a thumbs up showman. His most significant star moment yet might be a mere 48 hours from now as he tries for a knockout blow to Team Kasich in Ohio's winner take all primary. Trump loyalists say the people have picked Trump, the politicians have picked Kasich whose backers are sweating today's Cruz rally in Columbus, sensing it's a way to siphon votes from Kasich and create a two-candidate race after Tuesday. Trump took aim at favorite targets. But the level of dishonesty of the press is beyond belief, far greater than you would ever think. Took questions from admirers. And I've been waiting 17 hours to see you today. I got here Unbelievable. 11, I got here 11 o'clock last night. Got a hug from a woman from Nicaragua. I love your blue eyes. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's so nice. Keith Maupin was here, recalling the Trump broadside about John McCain not being a war hero because he was captured. Maupin, whose son was captured and killed in Iraq, asked for clarification. Because I think it's important for all these people here, yeah. and for a lot of veterans that's in Ohio, especially Ohio. And I know yeah. what you were doing. You know exactly what I was doing. But I wanted but you they to explain are heroes, that. Just so you understand, and real heroes, okay? Trump vowed to kill Common Core if elected, called for Pete Rose to be put in the Hall of Fame, and said if he's president, nobody's going to mess with the U.S. I hope you go out and I hope you vote and bring us home a big, beautiful victory on Tuesday. In Westchester, John London, WLWT News 5.